Welcome, Gemini's. <laughs> I'm back, guys. Happy to be here with y'all. So let's talk about September, guys. Let's see what's coming towards you guys for the month of September. This is going to be a general read, okay? So if it resonates with you, all the better. If it doesn't resonate with you, check your moon and your rising signs, okay? So whatever uh, comes out is what is the message that spirit wants me to relate to you. So let's see what we got here. If you are new to the channel, welcome. Go ahead and click that bell to subscribe. Look at that, 11, 11 a.m., 11, 11 a.m. Go ahead and subscribe, guys. You don't want to miss the messages that we have, all right, for the future. Now, let's talk, Geminis. Let's see what we got for September. We got the Death card, Scorpio energy. But this is an ending of transformation and the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so this is someone being single, independent, doing something for themselves, focus on themselves. We got the Nine of Pentacles under the deck, as well as the Ten of Cups here under the deck, and the Four of Wands under the deck. So somebody wants to be uh, in a full-fledged commitment here. Somebody wants the real deal. Somebody wants marriage. Somebody wants that next level commitment. So I feel like you don't want to be single. I feel like if this is if you're single, you don't want to do something by yourself. You want to do something to get to, together as a unit. Um, you don't want to do something alone. You don't want to be single. You don't want to feel single at this moment in time. Let's get together and let's do this together. Okay, let's let's work together. Okay, I'm getting support. I'm getting you want to support someone or someone wants your support, but I'm getting like a, a happy family here. And this is a wish fulfillment and a desire. All right, so let's see. All right, we got the four of pentacles. You have been holding back from saying you've been holding back okay you've been refraining from communicating or speaking your truth okay got the ace of swords you have been holding back telling this person that you know hey you know let's do this together now i feel like you're ready to open up and communicate but i feel like you've been you haven't been communicating Okay, you haven't been speaking your truth. You've been holding holding it back. I got the magician and the six of swords. So now I feel like, see, yeah, see now you're ready to make up your mind. You made up your mind, okay? Because I feel like before you was uncertain with the two of swords. Queen of swords. Two of cups. So this is a business partnership, three of pentacles. This is a business partnership, okay? You've been keeping quiet, not saying anything. You may have just been sitting back in the cut watching, okay? But now you've made up your mind, okay? And this is definitely a business partnership. For some of you, this is work-related. For some of you, this is just like going into business with someone or you and this person coming together, okay? You and someone else or a group coming together, <clears throat> All right. And see, before, like I said, you was uncertain. You was uncertain. You didn't make you had made up your mind. But now I feel like you you have made up your mind. OK, you have made up your mind with the magician and the six of swords. You're no longer sitting back in the cut, not saying anything. Show me past energy. We have the King of Cups, King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio's energy, and the Ten of Pentacles, and the Page of Swords. Okay, so this is somebody that you most definitely, I'm getting like this could be a husband, a wife, this could be someone that you're really close to, this could be family, because we got the Ten of Pentacles, okay? 
But you've been watching this. You've been watching this person blossom and bloom. Like you, 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 you're emotionally content. You're emotionally content. Okay. Um, but you just been sitting back watching. Like I'm just getting like you've been sitting back watching this person. Okay. And they're all over the place. And you're surprised by this. With the Tower card and the Knight of Wands and the Seven of Cups, that's saying that this person is over here, over there, doing this, doing that. And you just been sitting back watching and not saying nothing. You just been sitting back watching this person run around with a, uh, like a chicken with their head cut off. But, like I said, with the King Cups here, you're possibly kind of, like, smiling at this. You're possibly kind of, like, intrigued. Why is the King of Cups here? The Knight of Cups. Yeah. Okay. So, there is an offer here. Definitely someone asking for money or someone offering or um, initiating um, a sale. I'm getting that this is a business relationship. Look at this. Ace of Pentacles. All right. Knight of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles is definitely a offer of money. Okay. And I feel like, I feel like for some of you, this is business. I'm just getting that this is business. Okay. And you're happy to do this with the will of fortune. Like, I feel like you're going to give, you gave something a chance. You gave something a chance, even though you were afraid to. Okay. Even though you was kind of like, mm, with the eight of swords here, afraid. Okay. Your intuition was holding you back in your mind. You was, it was a, you was a prisoner to your mind in this situation, okay? And your intuition might have been telling you to hold on, let me wait. Let me be patient. Let me wait a minute. And let me see. Let me let me see how I'm gonna do this. Let me see. Okay. Because you're not trying to get <clears throat> you're not trying to get in any money issues with the King of Pentacles and the Five of Swords, right? But there's this offer on the table, okay? I feel like either you accepted an offer. You accepted an invitation to offer, but it was definitely something tangible because it was the Ace of Pentacles. You accepted something. Gladly accepted something. Yeah. Because see, look at this. You love this idea. We got the lovers. You guys' is energy. Okay. You guys' is energy. The lovers. Look at y'all. <laughs> Such a beautiful energy to have. But I feel like you love the idea. Okay, and you feel like it's going to be successful with the Six of Wands and the Two of Pentacles. Like, yeah, you've decided, you've made the decision that, you know what, let's do this. Let's do it. And look at this. You, you're happy. This is good news for you. You're happy about this news with the Page of Cups and the Sun. This is good news. Like, you're happy to hear this news. Okay, you're happy. And I feel like um, for future energy, let's see what we got. We got the two of wands, all right? So you're planning and plotting. You're prepared. You're you're making plans, okay? And I, I feel like some action is going to be taken. Somebody's coming full force. Somebody coming full force, okay? I'm not sure if it's you guys taking action or somebody else taking action, but whoever's taking the action is going to get done, okay? They, they're putting action behind this, okay? And somebody's, like, giving somebody... Um, this could be somebody shipping somebody something to them, a product, okay, Six of Swords. Because I got the Six of Pentacles and the Chariot. That's giving somebody the gold. That's giving somebody access to something. But I'm getting, I'm telling you, the wheels are starting to turn, all right? So whatever this is, I feel like you might have had your guard up about it. You may have been guarded with that Nine of Wands and the Five of Cups. Like, you know, I don't want to regret this later. Don't make me regret this. But I'm telling you, this new idea or this new something that you're passionate about is going, it's, it's definitely, it's definitely going to go in your favor. Or if this is somebody that you're around or affiliated with, it's going to blossom, okay? Somebody is definitely putting in that work. Somebody is definitely working on themselves, their self-esteem, uh, the glow up with the empress here, okay? Somebody, look, the justice and justice and the ace of cups. This reminds me of an oil. Ace of cups is that flowing, overflowing. The justice card is finding a balance. This is like alchemy to me. Okay, somebody here, we got the Queen of Cups, okay, and the Five of Wands, 
Okay, somebody may be competing, but I'm getting like with the two of cups. Some that the the I feel like it's a friendly. I feel like it's a friendly uh competition here. Okay. All right. So, let's see. I do want to see why the two of wands is here. Oh, that that flew out. I wish I could have saw how that just flew out. Okay, we got the world here. Okay, so I'm telling you, for for some of you, I'm feeling like this is a product, um, and that you're going into business. For some of you, a lot of people have been starting businesses, um, and that's the type of readers that I've been getting so far. A lot, a lot of people have ordered the money magnet oil, and are starting businesses. I have had so many people come to me about the money magnet oil and they're wanting to start businesses so the business like people are in business right now okay so if you guys are trying to start a product or y'all have something to offer the world okay the world is about to you about to take the world by storm most definitely most definitely most definitely a lot of y'all this is internet okay this is yeah it's saying don't be surprised don't be surprised Ooh, i like y'all energy look at that page of swords yeah that page of swords and that ten of pentacles and the temperance so most definitely y'all y'all are either being seen recognized or you're watching somebody and somebody's glowing up okay somebody's blowing up all right they doing good Yes, yes, Ten of Pentacles and a Temperance. Y'all could be dealing with Sagittarius. The Tower, I got Scorpio's energy. But I feel like... <clears throat> I feel like... Some of y'all dealing with a Pisces or a Scorpio. Y'all, I feel like... Um, <laughs> y'all been watching somebody or watch something in the cut. Yeah, like you might have felt you might have felt like you didn't know that you had you didn't know you didn't never would thought that you had this energy. Okay, like the strength card and the queen of pentacles like you didn't know that you had this. Like you didn't know that you could do this. You didn't know that you had this gift or this talent. <clears throat> because you know what People probably view as, you know, you just talk negative all the time. Or you always got something negative to say. Or you don't look at the positive side of the situation. This is possibly how people are viewing you, okay? Because I'm telling you, you didn't think or you didn't, never imagined. If this is somebody around you with this energy, like, you didn't notice that. You didn't know that this person had this in them. Um, and I feel like, and it's because somebody talked negative, you know, somebody always got something negative to say, or they look at the negative side of things, but things are about to start turning around. The will of fortune and the ace of pentacles is luck. This is the luckiest energy to have in a reading. So lots of luck is on like luck is on your side okay this situation here i'm loving this and i've been getting these type of readings lately like it's just like luck 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 people doing big things and i'm loving it i'm loving this energy i'm definitely loving this energy let me pull from the kipper deck and let's see what else we got what else can come out <clears throat> what other messages does spirit have for you What other messages are there for Gemini? What other messages are there for Gemini? <clears throat> what other messages are there for Gemini? Ooh, okay. All right, so we got um, we got unexpected income and official person. Didn't I tell y'all? Didn't I tell y'all? Like, if y'all haven't seen or if y'all have any doubt about an idea or something that somebody has to offer don't 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 doubt yourself or don't doubt this person because this is going to be so shocking okay we got main female so for a lot of you it's a female this is a female okay give me one more message for uh gemini and mature woman Ooh, this person is like Look, if this is you, 
Okay, you have grown. There's been so much growth. Okay, there's a lot of growth. And look at this. We got gift and community. Like the community is going. This is something big. Okay, something big is happening here. You guys have unexpected income in your future. Okay, official person. Something is being made official. Something is being stamped. And it is what it is. It's being stamped. It's being taken to the next level. Okay. And somebody here is mature. Like there could be an older woman involved. Um, let me see why unexpected income is here. Let's see. Oh, somebody's been investing. Seven of Pentacles. Somebody has been. Look at this. Ten of Pentacles. Temperance. Somebody's balancing their money. Okay, somebody is keeping their money intact, keeping a balance on it, keeping taps on it, um, and possibly have been doing it secretly. Okay, just kind of like in the background, kind of like trying to balance this out. But I get a, I got a big, 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 like my intuition is saying that you guys been investing, okay, and you're going to reap the benefits, okay? Benefits is getting ready to be reaped, all right? Just be patient. Official person. We got the judgment. Okay, there's an offer. Like I said, like Knight of Cups and the King of Cups. Some of y'all are definitely dealing with a water sign. But there's this final. Somebody has to put the final touches on something. The final touch. Oh, I like the way that sounds. Like, y'all, that's probably going to be the name of this video. The final touches. Okay? Somebody's like, um, somebody is loving the idea of something. and But I'm getting, there needs to be a final, a final touch. Somebody's got to put that final touch on there. Okay? All right? So, ooh, and like I said, it keeps coming out. It keeps revealing itself, the will of fortune and the ace of pentacles, okay? There's an offer or somebody is presenting something so gracefully, okay? And I feel like, I feel like that is the final touch. Like, somebody has to put the final touch. You guys got to put the final touch on something to, to, to make this thing be as great as I already know it is. Okay, we got mature women. So this could be like a mother or a grandmother or somebody else could like be in the picture. Oh, we got the seven of swords. Oh, seven of swords. Okay, somebody's giving somebody something. Six of pentacles and the chariot. This could be somebody giving somebody a ride. Be careful. Queen of wands, Leo, uh, Leo Sagittarius, Aries. But let's see, why is the seven of swords here? Mm, okay, four of pentacles. Yeah, somebody wants, be careful now, but be careful because there's a mature woman here. <clears throat> like I said, this person could be an older, like, um, like a grandmother. Like, I'm just not saying like that's the particular person, but they're like that type of energy. Like, they're like older, more mature. Be careful because somebody wants to take somebody's throne. We got the knight, uh, Aries is, uh, a this, the emperor is Aries energy. And the nine of cups, this is water energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But this is a wish fulfillment. Somebody wants authority. Okay, this is what it is. Somebody wants to take over. Um, be careful, because somebody might want to take over uh, your idea or whatever this is that you're working on. Um... Be careful with it. Somebody might try to take over or try to take over. Okay? Because, see, look, somebody might want you to cut ties with somebody with the Ten of Swords and the Two of Cups. Yeah, somebody may want you to cut ties with someone else and come work with them. I'm getting that as well. Somebody wants to take control. Okay? Now, with the imp with the mature, mature woman and the emperor, it could be an older person like a mother, a father, um, an aunt, an uncle, somebody like that, like one may want to take control of your, uh, what you have going on. 
and may want you to cut ties with somebody else here with the ten of swords and the two of cups so be you know be on the lookout for that we got a three of wands this is somebody waiting with the queen of cups pisces cast of scorpio ace of cups so just waiting for to see how somebody feels about that waiting to see how somebody feel but i feel like somebody cut somebody off block somebody or uh, i'm getting that and it's possibly like a mature or older person you may have to kind of like watch out for okay somebody here is competing with the five of wands and the justice <clears throat> but i'm getting like you i feel like this issue can easily be resolved and I feel like you are going to resolve this issue. But with the five of wands and the justice, that's just saying like somebody could be have some issues that still kind of need to be resolved. It could be like somebody still somebody's too emotionally attached to the situation and needs to find balance on their emotions too. But like I said, spirit is telling you to keep your eye out, nine of wands. Be careful, be on the lookout. You know, you can't never let your guard down when, when money and things get involved. You can't never really let your guard down. You got to watch everything and everybody and everything that's going on, okay? But, like I said, and for some reason, Geminis, I'm getting I, I'm getting that some of y'all could be pregnant, too, or find out that you're pregnant. But with the Eight of Pentacles, like I said, you have to be careful. You got to be careful who you build with, um, with the Nine of Wands and the Eight of Pentacles. Be careful who you build with, Okay. <clears throat> And I got the Empress and the Ace of Wands. Empress is motherly energy, um, feminine energy, very feminine energy. But the Ace of Wands is saying that there's this creative idea um, that could definitely blossom, okay? The Empress is definitely growth and abundance. And this is saying that this is, the Ace of Wands is a yes, okay? The Empress is definitely, like, she's all about abundance. She's all about growth and expansion but these two cards together can definitely symbolize pregnancy as well so some of y'all may be very fertile during this time as well too yeah see and like i said somebody feels like somebody's going to feel bad or lose everything so be careful what you speak or tell people when it comes to certain things um because you don't want people speaking negative over um over anything that you got going on especially when y'all got when y'all got unexpected income coming in and income has been flowing out through y'all reads okay so be careful of who you tell your ideas and things to or how far or how much you tell them you're just gonna have to go ahead and jump out there and do it um and then you know whoever gravitates to it gravitates to it all right so let's see what messages what message we have for gemini All right, we got meditation brings answers, okay? So I feel like you guys are possibly meditating or you guys need to do some meditation. We got within the next few uh, months, within the next few months, and then we also have be assertive. Okay, so you're going to have to take action because we got to take action here. And we got helpful people. Okay, so um, I feel like you guys are trying to get a group of people together. Um, you're taking action. You're you're doing the necessary steps. I feel like y'all are doing the necessary steps to get to where you guys want, want or need to be. Um, but definitely an uh, opportunity is on the horizon for you. Okay, there's this grand opportunity that's on the horizon. I feel like you're going to have support or you're trying to take action to get support. Um, and I feel like this is a time for you to do your meditation, do use visual boards, um, do money magic rituals, okay? Do things that will get you to where, you know, the set the intention to get what you need and where you need to be, okay? Because I feel like if it, if you aren't already there, it's on the horizon for you. Like, it's, it's, it's grabbable. It's right there. It's attainable. All right. So if this message resonated with you guys, make sure to leave me a thumbs up. If you would like to purchase the money magnet oil by the Empress, um, that information is going to be in the drop box below. OK, if you would like to book your very own personal reading, that information is going to be in the drop box below. Anything that you need is going to be in the drop box below in the description box. OK, so until next time, loves. Mwah.